All right, so welcome back to another video. So for this video, I'll be unboxing Keystone North America Deluxe Edition. Now, before I open the box, let's just take a look at this box. It is so beautiful. We've got this uh, Arctic Fox here and some brown bears here and the honeybee. And we've got a river otter over there. Then we've got more. We've got this... Uh, uh, seal over here and uh, then we've got a mountain lion and then over here we've got the owl that's cool a barred owl I believe a barred owl and we've got some plants then we've got a crab that's cool and uh, American alligator to boot and then over here we have some trees and we've got the polar bear as well. So it just goes to show you that this game isn't any particular area. It's actually pretty much any animal you can find in North America is probably going to be in this game, just about. So let's take a look and see what's inside now. Okay. Well, we got this thing. Hello friends, thank you so much for your support of our first game. So this is Rose Gauntlet Entertainment. This is from Rose Gauntlet Entertainment, and this is their very first game. So we just, just got their very first game. So, man, it's beautiful. And then here's the rule book with some other animals on it. We got the red fox here, and... um. I'm not exactly sure what this is supposed to be. I know maybe some sort of mole or something, or rodent or a prairie. Dog. No, not not a prairie dog. Maybe a prairie, maybe a groundhog or something. Um, then we got some deer. Then we got some some owls here. Cool. I think these are burrowing owls, but I could be wrong. Um, I'm not gonna take a look at the rule book because it just takes so much time. Oh, oh, oh! Are you? Oh, wow. It comes with a play mat. It actually comes with a play mat. Okay, okay, so we gotta set this aside for a moment. We gotta take a look at this play mat. Oh, sweet. Okay, let's see here. How do I get this off without taking too much time? Um. There we go. Okay. Wow. Okay, let's let's roll this. Let's roll this. Wow, a play mat. I didn't know it came with a play mat. That is cool. Okay, it is the deluxe edition, so I guess that makes sense. But still, wow, I love this play mat. Sweet got all sorts of animals on here too. A rabbit and we've got a bear over here and there's a bird up there, probably an eagle or hawk. Mountain lion. That looks like a road runner. Some coyotes probably or wolves. Probably coyotes. We've got some deer over there. Bighorn sheep up here. That's probably a bobcat. I think this is caribou. Wow, I just love this playmat. Oh, wow. What a nice surprise to find in a game. A playmat. Very cool. Um, I need to flat it out a little bit on this end, but that's just how most playmats are. Okay, let's now take a look at what's, what else is in this box. I'm, a suppo I'm, a suppo I'm assuming that these are just in here to keep the playmat from from rolling around or something. So we'll hold on to these because I think that's probably what their specialty is for. Uh, then we got some baggies because it looks like we've got some punch outs. Okay. So we've got acorn punch outs. Very cool. Um, we've got some more punch outs. Or 
very cool. What do they look like on the other side? Okay, cool, very cool. Then we've got some more punch outs. It looks like some of the punch outs came out on their own at some point. So maybe they're in the box somewhere. Um, but this is one side of them and this is what they look like on the other side. And another one came out. Okay. All right. Then we've got oh, slightly damaged, but I'm sure it's fine. What's this? Is this a rule book too? An assignment guide set up. Huh. There's a lot of lot going on with this. Okay, that's interesting. So maybe scenarios for the game or something. Interesting. Okay. Um, what are these envelopes? They're sealed, too. They definitely have something inside of them. Is this like a campaign game? Am I not supposed to open these? I have no idea. Um, we'll hold off on that. Okay, so we got these boards here. All right, so here's the player boards all opened up already. Um, so let's take a look at them. The boards. Oh, isn't that pretty? Very pretty. Beautiful. Beautiful. So that's one of the boards. Cool, cool. Okay, got more. Wow, that's magnificent. Beautiful. Sweet. Okay, we've got more of those player boards. We got this one. Ooh, there's the alligator. <laughs> cool. Got some turtles. Some more alligators. Very cool. Very beautiful. Wow. Gotta love these. Okay, so while I was opening up, the, up these uh, player boards, I decided to look at the rule book about these envelopes here, and they're intended to be opened as you play the game in obviously the particular order of one, two, three, four, five, and six. So even though it said you can technically, technically just open them all now and start playing with any challenges you want to, because each of these I guess have new challenges to the game, I think because there is so much content here already anyways, that I will keep these secret for myself as well as you guys. Now, if you really want to see what's inside these, I'm sure somebody who did an unboxing of this will have opened these up, okay? I'm sure you can find someone who was willing to open these up, but I think, you know what? Okay, I'm just gonna open up one, just the first one, just to see what is potentially inside these, okay? We'll just open up the first one, how's that? Okay, so we'll open up number one and then put the cards right back into the envelope as if I hadn't opened them. There's not too many cards in there, so. Ooh, we got an ocelot, a collared peccary, another ocelot, and a collared peccary. So it looks like each one will give, add two more animals to the game and two of each of them, basically, it looks like, okay? So, uh, as much as I. Uh, want to see them all um you know what i changed my mind we are opening all of them so spoilers if you don't want to see what's in the envelopes skip ahead okay i want to carefully open these because i want to kind of seal them back up so hold on if you're still watching this 
Okay, this was what was in number two. The Sphinx Moth and the Nine Banded Armadillo. So two more animals. Cool, cool. Very cool. So we will put them back into the sealed envelope and keep them there until I get to them at some point. Okay. Number three. And yes, we still haven't looked at these cards yet, but I did open them all up, so it won't take long to go through them. I also found out that this is the field journal here, and this is mostly for solo, if you're going to play the solo variant. It's basically got 20 scenarios in here. 20 scenarios. So it's like a campaign game if you're playing by yourself. That is cool. And then here's the score sheet, so I'll just show that real quick. Okay, and I found those tokens that had been punched out, so they're there now. So other than the cards here and what's in left in the envelopes, there, there isn't much else left to look at. Okay, so we have, in number three, we have the Mallard and the Canada Goose. Okay, all right. So that was in number three. Put those back, seal them up nice, nice and good. Okay, four. Let's see what's in four. Okay, hold on. I gotta open this carefully. There we go. Okay, so number four had the Florida Panther and the Florida Manatee. Very cool, very cool. Okay, five. Okay, five has sockeye salmon and the Alaskan moose. Interesting. Okay, that was a number five. We'll put that back into the fifth envelope, sealed inside. And number six. What's in number six? This last one is not wanting to open without ripping. Come on. There we go. Whew. Okay. And for the last one, number six, we have <laughs> Bigfoot. <laughs> we've got Bigfoot. And we've got the Jackalope. Okay. So some animals that were never truly discovered. Interesting. Okay, well, I'm glad they saved that one for last, because I certainly don't need to play with the Bigfoot or the Jackalope to enjoy this game. Okay, so let's see what we have here in these that, that you can just normally see and start playing with. So that was a mangrove tree crab. Okay, pronghorn antelope, northern raccoon, Ooh, I love this one. Sidewinder Rattlesnake. The Red Fox. The Red Wolf. Okay, so that was a seal. It wasn't a seal line. It was a seal. The Ringed Seal. The Rock. Tamargan. Tamargan, something like that. The Atlantic Salt Marsh Snake. Ooh, that's a beautiful snake. Then we got some more plants. Ooh, the snail kite. I wonder if the apple snail is in this game. But anyways, the snail kite is in this game, and it's definitely got an apple snail in its... Okay, snail kite. Snowshoe hare. Ooh, I love snowy owls. 
So that's beautiful. Snowy Owl. Swallowtailed Kite. Vancouver Island Marmot. White-tailed Deer. Ooh, there's the Wolverine. Turkey Vulture. Some trees. Mexican Gray Wolf. North American River Otter. Monarch Butterfly. A, a Piping Plover. Or Plover. Ooh, this guy. The Alligator Snapping Turtle. Very cool. The Emperor Goose. Sandtail Crane. Ringtail Cat. California Condor. Arctic Wolf. Oh, I don't like this one. Spruce Fur Moss Spider. I'm not going into a spruce forest if that's where they live. Okay. Northern Flying Squirrel. Some more trees. The Wood Duck. Ooh, it's a Hellbender. It's an Eastern Hellbender. <laughs> oh, nice. American Alligator. Oh, beautiful. An Arctic Fox. Bald Eagle. North American Beaver. Bighorn Sheep. American Bison. American Black Bear. Black Footed Ferret. Bumblebee. I knew it. Those were burrowing owls. I knew it. Woodlands caribou. Cottontop rabbit. Coyote. Another American alligator. Different picture, but an American alligator. Another tree. A doll sheep. A dusky grouse. Those live in Idaho, I think. Rocky Mountain elk. Golden eagle. Ooh, it's a desert tortoise. I've worked with these guys quite a bit. And that's it for that grouping of cards. But it looks like there's more animals. What we're gonna do is there's nothing else but the sides of the cards in this box. So I am gonna bring the camera down so I can rest my hands while I'm showing you the cards. Okay, so forest woodland, a couple of them. Some grasslands, the alpines, the wetlands, uh, some maybe some player aids or something. I don't know, but definitely not player aids, I suppose. But there are quite a few of those. Um, American alligator again, Arctic fox. Looks like these are all the same animals thus far that we had in the last grouping. Nothing different in this grouping of animals, seems like. Okay, American Red Squirrel, Northwestern Gray Wolf, okay, that's new. Grizzly Bear, Black-tailed Jackrabbit, Des a Desert Kangaroo Rat, yeah, that's definitely new. So that's a lemming, okay, I had no idea what that was. Brown Lemming, Canada Lynx, tree, long-tailed weasel, northern green frog, a Mexican spotted owl. So it wasn't a barred owl, it was a Mexican spotted owl. Mountain goat, mountain lion, mule deer, muskox, Virginia opossum. Okay, some mangroves with some fish on it. Um, peregrine falcon, Polar bear, black tailed prairie dogs, and it looks like that's it for this grouping cards. And it looks like these are probably all the same as the other stack of animals, but we'll see. Yeah, that's not new. We already did these. All of these we've done. I don't see anything different yet. All the same. Peregrine falcon, polar bear. Yeah, and then these were in the first one, the first grouping, you know, like the rattlesnake and all that, so very cool. So I guess that's all of the animals in the game, which is quite a bit. And then of course, though, those, there were those sealed envelopes, if you watched those. So there was a few extra animals in the game. 
regardless. So, man, so much content. So now you guys know what is in this game in Keystone, North America. Okay? Well, thank you guys for watching. If you guys liked this unboxing video, don't forget to leave me a like, and I'll see you guys again next time. Bye.